Thank you guys for joining me today's episode. I bring you Dee Mwango, a famous Kenyan YouTuber in Uganda. Please sit back and enjoy. So welcome. I'm really loving it. So Uganda, well represented. Can you show them the tag? Uganda. I'm so happy. I'm loving it. And this is where I'm staying in this beautiful apartment as you see it, you know, where the rich hide. Lol. Anyway, guys, so let's get out. First, we need to open the gates. Ish. Ooh. All right. So I'm here with Sarah uh, Doris. <laughs> some clothes. <laughs> you have to use some energy. Okay. Do it. Oh. I think that's enough. Yeah. <laughs> Um, Sarah Tuarez, thank you so much for coming, for checking us, and this is Uganda, Uganda is so beautiful, mm -hmm. and come and visit us, and enjoy, so guys, welcome to Bobby Wine's country, <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just loving everything, you know, and one of these fine days, I just have to go and look for Bobby Wine, I just hope I want to find him, because actually he's the reason why I left Kenya, I just have to find him, you know, and I'm so proud and happy that he's already in the country, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he came, came back. back. <laughs> I just can't wait to yeah. meet him in person. So wish me well. I hope I want to find him. Anyway, guys, on today's video, I want to take you along to one of the biggest markets here in Jinza. And I just want to see what $10 can get me here in Jinza. So let me show you how this uh, Ugandan currency looks like. And this is the biggest note here. How Ugandan currency looks like 50,000. I hope you can see it well 50,000 Ugandan shillings. So, in terms of dollars, it's like 10 to 13 USD. So, because I just checked in, in a new Airbnb, I have to get food and all that for me to survive. So, let's get to see what 50,000 Ugandan shillings or rather 10 to 13 USD in between there, you know, that's where the exchange rate lies can get us here in Bobby Wines country. So come along, let's go and do the shopping. So we have to board a motorbike and actually motorbikes are the major means of transport here so that they can take us to town. So yeah, who should climb first? <laughs> okay, hey, see you at the market. guys we are inside the market so let's do the challenge let's see what 10 USD can get us here in Uganda or rather 50,000 Ugandan shillings so first we want to start by getting a carrier bag so we're getting a carrier bag here wow this is so funny because in my country we don't use plastic bags but in Uganda this is what they use Wow. <laughs> okay. So how much does it cost? Two thousand. Okay. You already paid? No, two hundred. Two hundred. Two hundred. So it goes for two hundred shillings. So I give it to you. Okay, wow. So we're also buying the eggplant. I gave her one thousand. Wow. Oh, no. In terms of dollars, 10 cents. Yeah. So this goes for 10 cents, all of this and their eggplants. And I really love them. Okay. Wow. She added that. This is so sweet. <laughs> okay. So we get bananas. So we want to get some bananas here. Go for 500 Ugandan shillings, which is the same as 20 cents something, right? So let's take two. I think two will be okay. Oh, really much, right? 
What about this? This one will be maybe they are in too small. Come help me choose because I feel like the majority of them are are ripe. So we are trying to get some avocados also. And which what's the name of this fruit? Guys, let me know in the comment box what's the name of this fruit. What's the name of this fruit? This is a coconut. No. Cocoa. Oh wow, this is the cocoa itself. So how is it eaten when ripe? The fruit inside. The fruits inside. Maybe you should have one. I should try this. Yeah. Let me know if you have this in your country, but I know Ghana, you really have this in clinch. Right? So, avocados, two of them. Yeah. So, this is the change. How much is this? Hold this for me. So, this is 10, 20, 30, 40, 40,000, and this is 500. <laughs> 5,000. So you have 45,000 as change. Wow. So yeah, let's keep shopping. Thank you. Thank you. Wow, Ugandans are really friendly, man. And I'm really enjoying being here. So we're still shopping and I can see that girl right here. Can we have a little of this? I really love this. It reminds me of my country, man. You know, in my country, we call it the girl. So this goes for... One thousand. Yeah. Yes. Okay. That's your turn. Wow. One thousand shillings. <laughs> add that. Add more. I'll give the new map. It's like for one five. It's like for one five. Thank you. How this one? Let me see. This is ten. Okay. She'll give us change. So we still halfway. We not yet done. Let's see if it's possible to spend fifty thousand Ugandan shillings or ten years be here in Uganda. Wow! So when I also get some matoke here in Uganda, they call them matoke or rather bananas in simple terms. Two thousand is which one? Two thousand. What do you think, sir? Like this, like, for 2000 yeah. All of these? Or all of these for 2000 Yeah. Okay, wow. So all of this goes for 2000 yeah. All right. Because we are in Uganda, let's enjoy Uganda's uh, staple food, which is mantoke. <laughs> okay. Okay. Not so hard much. That's enough. Wow, Ugandans are so kind. So let's pay 2,000. Oh, these are right. 2,000. Thank you, man. So I want to get some tomatoes also. How much is this? 6,000 or 600? 6,000? Yeah, they are too much. No, we are going to keep them in the fridge. <laughs> but maybe you mix with them. We mix, right? So we are also buying green paper. And how much is that? Per kilo. Per kilo goes for? So a kilo is 4,000. We also need some carrots, I guess. But maybe want to get them from somewhere else. How much are you selling? 2,000. 2,000. Per kilo? 2,000. 2,000. 2,5 per kilo? That's expensive. Yeah. Ginger is expensive. Yeah. Ginger is expensive. Yeah. I've been told ginger is really expensive here in Uganda. <laughs> Get 
close the so these are sweet bananas how much are they selling three thousand so this goes for three thousand oh wow so are we buying so he bought bananas at three thousand is this the best yeah three thousand for the sweet bananas so this is the cooking oil here in Uganda and it's called Buto. Fortune Buto. Fortune Buto. Wow. And it goes for how much? Three thousand five hundred. Three thousand five hundred. In terms of dollars, it's like uh, how much? One dollar. One dollar. Yeah. Wow. So we also bought salt. Salt goes for eight eight hundred. Close to twenty cents or something, right? So in total, we're remaining with twenty. We're remaining with thirty thousand, right? So thirty thousand Ugandan currency to go. <laughs> Okay. So guys, we're still looking for cooking flour, but so far we've really shopped all that we needed. And so far what I can say is it's impossible to spend $10 here in Uganda. You see, you still have a lot with us, but you still have the money, you know. It's not yet finished, which is so interesting. So it means you can easily survive here in Uganda. You can get our food like for two weeks with less $10 here. So finally we back home or rather we back to our airbnb after doing the crazy shopping so that's all we bought and i think this is really great it's gonna take us like close to you know one week and a half or something right mm. so all i can say is life in uganda it's kind you know it's affordable and with less ten dollars you can really have a lot like we do right here because we have all that we need so thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. Ciao, ciao. Stay positive.